Okay, so I'm Kristen, and today we're going to talk about um, some options that we have for such technology to be able to have children read stories or other things that they may not be able to because they have a physical disability or um, a motor skill problem. So, one thing that we have found is uh, if you go to kids.nypl.org, it's the New York Public Library. They have an option where you can read children's books online. So if you click on this, and then you're going to go down to Tumble Book at the New York Public Library. Okay, and so we're going to click on Storybooks right here. It's going to bring up this page, and it has a whole bunch of different stories that you can choose from. We're going to choose this top one right here, 50 Below Zero. Push Read Online, and this page is going to come up. Let's get that. In it's going to read the book the night, for us. Jason was asleep. Okay, pause this. And you can go um, have it change the pages for you or go manually. And you can just click this button and go to the next page. And, there was his father who was and it'll read the story for you. He was sleeping on top so, of the refrigerator. this just makes an easy way so that students are able to um, read books and um, are able to comprehend what it's saying and not have to hold a book or have someone read it to them. They can come to the computer and get the book. And so this is just an easy way and an easy access to be able to read and comprehend things. <laughs>